But he had a strong finish to both of those games. Maybe it was just situational. But um, how do you leverage some of that maybe into in better opportunities early in the game for you offensively? Um, I would just say probably asserting myself earlier in the game, trying to be more aggressive earlier, uh, see if I can catch a rhythm before, like, you know, it's too late in the game and stuff like that. Coach said that they moved away from maybe setting screens for him, just kind of let them operate. Does that give you a little more freedom when it's just you and another guy? Uh, yeah, I would say so because I believe in my abilities to, you know, probably beat my first defender off the bounce. And then after that, it's kind of easier. I just have to make the read and see who's coming to help and all that. Uh, I feel fine with both, but you know, kind of when you're just going one on one with the guy, you uh, it's easier to make a read because then you know who's coming from what side and stuff. Ball screen, the defense is usually in a scramble, so it just makes it a little harder to make a read. This is a very ball screen heavy offense typically. Have you had to adjust to playing with that, or is that something you play with most of your career in college? Um, I've always kind of played with ball screens and the balls in my hand. Uh, throughout my career, so it just took a little bit more adjusting because BYU is a different system of ball screens, but it's always been a thing for me. St. Mary's a little different tempo style as a team. What do you see on film from that you've seen so far this week? Uh, from what I've seen on film, they've been pretty deliberate. You know, they're gonna walk the ball up. They're gonna make they're gonna make you guard for thirty seconds. They're gonna you know shoot two foot shots in the paint, and it's, it's not sexy basketball, but you know they're a good team and they get stuff done. Coach mentioned how physical they can be. Uh, yeah, he told us that when we drive to the paint, you know, they're going to come up under you. He said, don't look to the bench, don't look to the rest for foul calls. Just expect it's going to be a physical game and we're going to get beat up. So we're just going to have to play tough and, you know, play hard 40 minutes. What was the, the mood of the team directly after the, what, the weekend and then kind of how things have progressed this week as you look um, you know, obviously when you go on the road and you lose two straight, no one's happy about that. But, uh, you know, we had all of Sunday off. You know, everybody could just you know, get the bitterness out. But uh, yesterday on the court, everyone came with a fresh mind, fresh heart. We had a good day of yesterday's practice. And then I feel like we had another good day as well today. So, you know, guys are kind of just looking forward, you know, kind of just kick that under the rug this past weekend and uh, get ready for Saturday. Is there anything you guys can do to, I guess, get more consistency in the three-point shot, if that makes sense? Um... I would just say probably getting easier looks for us, you know, getting when we have guys exhausting rotation, extra passes, hockey assists, stuff like that, you know, just so we're e shooting easier shots. Corner threes and all that type of stuff. Yeah. Okay. Driving kicks, you know, paint touches, give it to Foos, give it to a Tiki, make the defense collapse, and then kick it back out. Okay. What did you kind of attribute some, somewhat to the, the uptick in turnovers a little bit, especially this last week? Um, was there anything in particular that you noticed that? Uh, I can start with Thursday. I can just say I, f I feel like we were pretty caught off guard with how physical Santa Clara was. You know, we kind of seen it on film and the coaches told us, but it was a different story when we actually, you know, got on the court on Thursday and felt it. Me, myself, I can speak. I was, when I checked in the game, I was like, whoa, these dudes, like, you know, they, they hit you when you come across the lane, you know, their defense, they're handsy and stuff. So that, and then um, Saturday, they were also pretty physical too and aggressive and, you know, they tried to speed you up. So it was two different looks, but...